Have you ever wondered what the most powerful event recorded in recent human history might be? Well, let's travel back in time to June 30, 1908, in the remote wilderness of Siberia. Here, a mysterious cosmic event known as the Tunguska event took place. Picture it, an ordinary day transformed into an extraordinary spectacle. Imagine a force so powerful it flattened 80 million trees over an area of 2,000 square kilometers yet left no crater. This, my friends, is just the beginning. The morning of June 30, 1908 started as any other morning in the remote Siberian wilderness. Then, without warning, the tranquility was shattered. A brilliant fireball, brighter than the sun, streaked across the sky. It was an ethereal sight that stirred awe, fear, and curiosity in the hearts of those who witnessed it. This was not a shooting star making a fleeting streak across the sky. This was something much more potent, and it was heading straight for Earth. As it descended, the fireball exploded with a force that would dwarf the most powerful explosives of the time. The roar of the explosion was heard as far as a thousand miles away. Even at that distance, people reported sounds like artillery fire or the rumble of an approaching storm. Closer to the epicenter, the shockwave was so powerful that it knocked people off their feet and shattered windows. The landscape was instantly transformed. 80 million trees spread over an area of more than 2,000 square kilometers were flattened in an instant. It was as if an unseen giant had swept a massive hand across the land, leaving a trail of devastation in its wake. Yet in a twist of fate, the remoteness of the region that had once made it so inhospitable now played a crucial role in mitigating the human toll. The vast wilderness was largely devoid of human life. Thus, despite the immense power of the explosion, there were no reported fatalities. The event was as mystifying as it was destructive. There was no impact crater, no fragments of a meteorite, nothing that could provide a definitive answer to what had just transpired, but the effects were indisputable. In a matter of moments, the serene Siberian wilderness had been transformed into a stark landscape of devastation. In a matter of seconds, a seemingly ordinary day turned into a day that would be etched in the annals of human history. In the aftermath of the event, the remote location and the socio-political conditions of the time meant that it took almost two decades for the first scientific expedition to reach the site. When the team finally embarked on their journey into the Siberian wilderness, they were met with a sight that defied all expectations. There was no crater. Instead, nearly 80 million trees were flattened, their trunks lying in a radial pattern away from the epicenter. This was not the aftermath of a typical asteroid impact. The absence of a crater suggested that the object exploded in the atmosphere, and the immense shock wave was what caused the devastation below. Further studies revealed even more peculiarities. The area was found to be abnormally rich in radiation, much higher than the surrounding regions. This was a clue, but to what? The peculiarities of the Tunguska event sparked a plethora of theories. Some suggested it was a meteorite that exploded before hitting the ground. Others proposed it was a comet made mostly of ice which would have evaporated upon impact, leaving no trace of a crater. The most outlandish theories even proposed a mini black hole or an alien spacecraft being the cause of the event. Despite numerous theories, the Tunguska event remains one of the biggest unsolved mysteries of our time. The Tunguska event may have happened over a century ago, but its impact is still felt today. This colossal event, the largest asteroid impact recorded in human history, altered our perception of the cosmos and our place within it. It made us realize that we, on our little blue planet, aren't as isolated as we might think. The Tunguska event was a wake-up call, highlighting the potential threat posed by asteroids and comets. In its wake, various asteroid monitoring programs sprang to life. These programs, like the Near-Earth Object Observations Program, constantly scanned the skies, keeping an eye out for any cosmic threats that might be headed our way. These initiatives wouldn't exist today without the lessons learned from the Tunguska event. It was a catalyst for understanding the very real danger that space debris poses to our planet. The Tunguska event serves as a stark reminder of the cosmic threats that exist and the importance of vigilance in monitoring our skies.